You know, something about his appearance that I've always, this is going to, this is going to sound a little bit out there. You know how he's got that line um, in between his eyes on top of his nose? I wanted to open it up and smell it. Oh my God, Quinn, what is <laughs> what? what? I don't know. No, Quinn. I think I, <laughs> Quinn. I, I think it would smell like stone, uh. actually, but I didn't initially think that, but now I think that, but I don't know. I'm sorry. I. I could have, you could have given me like six hours to think of what you were going to say, and I would have never in my whole life <laughs> thought of that. Well, I do want to put my finger in there, though, and just wiggle around. <laughs> I love that little thing. I've always, I've loved that little thing forever, and I wonder if you've had that forever. It's probably just gotten more, you know, defined as he's gotten older. Um, but yeah, Quinn does have a thing about smells. You know, and honestly, this is going to kind of justify where that came from, but growing up, I had a pug and they all have this <laughs> wrinkle right above their nose. And I honestly, like I did relate <laughs> to you, like John C. Riley and a pug just because of that wrinkle. Um, and my pug Jake had a wrinkle roll. And I like to just like rub it a little bit. So that's probably where this is coming from. And I do mm -hmm. hope that sheds a little bit of normalcy on this conversation. No. Normal. It doesn't, but we can <laughs> continue.